Now, before, before we proceed, I guess I should make a short extra video on how we actually find Slade. There should be a link in the description field below. Actually, there already is one, but I should profile it closer in this video, I guess. We should find the latest stable ver version of Slade. I want you to get your version of choice. Once again, I'm going to get the 64-bit binary because um, I have a 64-bit system. If you are unsure, get one of these, but it's not that um, it's not going to crash your computer or anything if you have uh, something that doesn't work. We went through this in the install video. We are going to find, um, in my case, my builder and loader. I'm going to install it there, or at least download it there for now. And I am going to go there in a minute. Once we are there, like I installed the Builder and GC Doom, we are going to do the same with Slade because it's just... So we're going to pack, unpack it to Slade and the version number you have. It might not be the same as mine if you are doing this in the future. Once we have it, have the folder, we are going to delete the download. We're going to go into the wrong folder, dude. We're going to go into Slater, Slade, Slater, Slade directory, and we are going to start it. This is our new and uh, unused Slade, or since I uh, really just updated mine, I already have a um, file here. But you won't have that. And we might as well, uh, or I might as well, at least you can go to uh, make it a shortcut down here. I'm going to drag it up here where I have my doom stuff. And we can close that. I just realized there's one thing we can do as well now, so we'll save time later. Go to this page, the link will be in the description as well. Get this program. Whatever. Download. Put it, let's put it within the slide folder, save it, and then we'll go back there. Once we're back here, go back into slide and just uh, 7-zip them out into their own folder. Once again, we can delete the download. We don't need it. Back in Slade, we go into Edit, Preferences, and once it's loaded, <laughs> go to Graphics, PNG. You might need to uh, um, 
click this arrow to expand it and go to PNG. And we are going to find the three files that we just downloaded. They should be under where you put it. This is PNG out, which is there. PNG crush, which is there. And uh, PNG, what's it? Optimize something. This one. Apply. OK. Now, when we uh, open any file and put um, put something in it, at least uh, graphics of any sort, it would be nice to um, optimize it to take as little room as possible. And uh, with that, those files would, will come in handy. So anyway. And in the next video, <laughs> we are going. I am going to show you how to add a custom texture to your to your wood. In the meantime, this has been your host, the Lazy Gamer, logging off. Bye, guys.